nothing gets classy feminine and just I got my ish together like a bob wig this one here is glueless it has the perfect color to match my complexion the curls are also perfection my first wig definitely did their thing with this one and I just give all of the things and above so feminine so beautiful and I'm absolutely excited to share this gorgeous girl with you guys I created this look and it's super beginner friendly so if you're interested in seeing how we got this look keep on watching so for starters this is the packaging my first wig has some of the best packaging as well as some of the greatest quality wigs on the market this is what she looks like straight out of the box of course i'll show you all of the goodies that were included in my package at the end of the video so stay tuned for that but this is our gorgeous gorgeous girl she's a lace front wig and you guys can see this is the inside construction of the cap she comes with this gorgeous brown color she comes with the curls and she also comes with this adjustable elastic band so i'm not going to waste any time i'm going to go ahead and put her on and try her on for size she definitely fits glueless Everything about this one gives like 10 out of 10, I'd highly recommend. Even before I even put a comb to it, I can tell you that this is one for sure that would be perfect for any girl's collection. So here I am just combing her out. I wanted to see if I should fire up the curling iron or the wand curler. The curls were not folding none. So I was like, okay, this is gonna be super simple and easy. I'm giving you guys a close up look at the hairline and you guys can see there's not gonna be much work on this one. So I'm just gonna go ahead and pull her back and we can literally just get to work so one of the only things you have to do for install is to cut off the excess lace to amp it up a notch i did pull out my eyebrow razor which gives a better more flawless cut especially when you're not going to be bonding her down this is going to help it to look a lot more melted of course you got to trust the process i'm going to do it on both sides being sure to cut off any excess lace around the ear here i am just making sure we don't have to bond her down you gotta put her in sport mode and try to make sure you don't need to add any kind of glue or adhesive and she's not going anywhere you just find a place you want her to be put her there make sure that everything is perfect and flat and laid you're good to go but this here is a secret trick to melting your wigs we in the wig community love to do this especially with like synthetic lace wigs i'm bringing her here to the real hair community and this is pretty much just your favorite mousse and you kind of just apply a generous amount towards the hairline you can push all of the hair straight back i kind of did the finesse edges not baby hair just edges to it to kind of give it my own little flair pulling the hair back and we're just going to add a melt belt on top this is going to give the illusion that the hair is a lot more melted you guys see what it looks like first of all or beforehand and you're going to see the magic this step creates now while that dries, I'm going to go ahead and do the dynamic duo, clearing up or cleaning up the parting. You guys can see when I just went ahead with that rat tail comb, there was a little bit more parting space, which you guys know I love an elongated or extended parting. Now I'm going to take that wax and I'm going to fire it up with the electric hot comb and really get in there and just melt the lace and all of the hair around the lace area down. This is going to give a more flat, clean finished look in my opinion so i'm not stingy in this step i kind of take my time and just get it as smooth as i can there's nothing i dislike more than seeing like my flawless beauties come out with a beautiful wig and there's so many lumps all around so this is my step to kind of take that away now i'm going in with a portable fan to just make sure everything is dry along the hairline and look how well it melted it's a still 100 percent glueless i'll show that later in the video but you don't want to lift it at this point because if it's already melted when you lift it it's not going to be as snatched as it was before you lifted it if that makes any sense so i'll show you guys but just wait a little bit longer in the video to see the magic here i am just tinting the lace and i'm using a powder this time in the parting i felt like it was like bleached and the lace was tinted and everything was good but i just wanted to add again my own touch to customize it to my own skin tone i highly recommend you do this with your own wigs as well if you see a fit taking that same exact powder along the hairline just to make sure everything looks perfect and again this is not baby hair i didn't trim anything short it's literally just you know me swooping it like edges now i'm gonna go ahead and curl or touch up the curls in the hairline again this one has a beautiful curl pattern to her already but i wanted to add the feathered effect in the front so i kind of just finessed it by adding a little bit of curl just to that very front and then i did one more like section behind that to really bring it home and you're gonna see it's gonna marry everything together where it's not like 
you won't tell the difference or you won't look like okay she has two different type of curl patterns going on it's gonna look smooth and flawless and be a great transition but it gives me that feather bang that i crave so much and you guys can see you just kind of comb it out and pull it back to your liking and again i'm just touching everything up i had already done the parting but i felt like it was a little bit more yellow tone so like a little orangey yellow so i went in and made it a little bit more brown and that's the thing about it even when you do a step you may have to go back in and touch it up until you get the desired look that fits you now i think i'm done with the look and i'm absolutely in love this caramel colored lace wig is absolutely gorgeous went ahead and changed but this is a look at the packaging they included that um portable wig stand and i love that because you can travel with that one they also gave me this flyaway tamer as well as the pink dust bag this stuff works with the dynamic duo as like a wax stick now this is a reusable pouch and it's double sided which is really cute. Inside they did include our crocodile clips which these are essential for doing my hair. A rat tail comb which says my first wig on it as well as some brown wig caps which will pair perfectly with any wig for you, your to match your complexion. Here I am just adding a flexible hold hairspray. This has become a holy grail step. I love the flexible hairspray. I haven't used this in many years and I just don't know what I've been doing without it beforehand. But this is the final result. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to check this cutie out. I have a direct link to her in the description box. As I mentioned, she is 100% glueless. We didn't blonde her down at all. She's 16 inches in length. And of course, I have all the details on her down below in the description box. Lace wear. She's absolutely perfect. Thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Smooches.